and welcome back to Handwriting with Miss Samuel. Today we're doing some more subject verb agreement, but for this subject verb agreement, I do not want you to use your charts. I want to see how much we know from memory, okay? We've been using our charts, we've been looking back at them, so we're so familiar with this, we should be able to identify them right away. Let's do our one practice sentence, and then I'm gonna explain your homework. Here we go. First practice. Ants is so tiny. I want you to do like Miss Samuel, read it in your head. Here we go. And out loud, ants is so tiny. So immediately, what do you find wrong with that sentence? What do you find wrong with that sentence? Say it out loud, say it out loud so I can hear you. Ah, ants is so tiny. So I know immediately that is does not sound right. So I'm gonna change that to ants, cross it out, are, so tiny, and I know that sounds much better. And I know that's correct because I'm gonna check with my chart, okay? So the first time I want you to have your chart turned over or just not next to you at all. But then I want you to go back and make sure it's correct because we have to check to see if our sentences are correct. So we're gonna go ahead and give ourselves a check. Beautiful. Let's look at the next three sentences. This is your homework so you can stop right here. Okay, the first one says, I were really confused. Mm, think about it, you're gonna do it for homework, so think about it now. Second one, we was so cold, we had to get our jackets. Think about that one, what sounds funny or what sounds correct. The last one, my brother is so nice, he always shares with me. Think about it, my brother is so nice, he always shares with me. What's right, what's wrong, we don't know. Make sure to see that you have the right subject verb agreement. Again, I want you the first time, do not use your chart. Try it by yourself. When you're finished, go back and check, okay? Make sure you're seeing if these sentences are correct or if there's anything that you need to edit, okay? Can't wait to see your sentences, friends.